Wusu Bempa is actually completely enraged at this point, and he believes that somehow he's being attacked. What he had forgotten is that people had followed him and all his utterances up to this point. And therefore, what he seemed to be saying is that he only has this revelation about the fact that Mama will be the next president only when the prayer was going on at the time. Mm -hmm. Here's what I think I can see what happened. Owusu Bempa already knew this. He may have done his groundwork already. But then when he saw the pastors over there, just as he had always loved to be so that he can be recognized, mm -hmm. he realized this was a great opportunity to do that. Mm -hmm. So he turned to... Um, uh, what's God? The MP from Ningo Pran Pran. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. And no, when, no, no. when he said to, yeah, when, when he went to him, the guy realized I was smart to realize that no, I'm not going to be able to speak for you. Since you got the revelation, get the mic and say that Wusu Bempa was put on the spot. And he didn't know what to do than to be able to say exactly what he had told the gentleman. And that was how it became news. Mm -hmm. Remember, mm -hmm. All alone, Uwusu Bempa has told us that he was never going to prophesy this year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what, what, why the prophecy at that time? He First of all, he should blame himself for his own utterances. Now let me tell you something that Uwusu Bempa has done that he did. Remember just last week, Uwusu Bempa was on the pulpit and said that, um, Cecilia, I mean, at this point, there's only one person that can call me in. And I don't know, but if that calls that guy calls that person calls me, then I might change something. Yeah, Otherwise, yeah. It's fine. I remember. And and when he and when he was saying that, what he seemed to be saying is that that person has not called me, and I'm praying that that person doesn't call me because if that person doesn't call me, and I will wait till the person calls me after the election. So what he seemed to be saying is that he was the one that is actually really doing all of these things. And then that individual call. So we were even wondering, was it Kennedy Ajepon or was it Nanado that he was expecting to get a call from so that he can be able to avert whatever is about to happen? He had already done that. So he himself should not be telling us that this is what God has done and there is nothing much anybody can do. He had actually really do. Here's how he got himself into that situation. He has already been disappointed about the fact that somehow he's not getting the recognition that he has got from, from the NPP. Mm -hmm. And that in 2016, he was the one that he had done all, so much. Although other people may have done, he had done so much, and he's not being recognized. And so here's the situation he got himself in. He, he found that he was in the position where Kusi Boatin had already predicted already for NPP win. Mm -hmm. And I, Dakwa uh, Yadom and others have already predicted for NDC win. Where can he go there for? If he decides to go with, and NPP has already recognized Kusi Buatin <laughs> as their prophet. Mm -hmm. So if for some reason he goes to Kusi Buatin, he predicts and he helps NPP, mm -hmm. the recognition will still go to Kusi Buatin because he made the mistake by saying, I'm not going to be able to, to, to prophesy this year. So those who prophesied, yes. Yeah. So prophesied, those who prophesied earlier had already got that recognition. So if and people wins. Everybody is going. And remember, during the manifesto, it was Kusibuati who prayed for Baumia before it was actually re uh, released. So therefore, the recognition is already there. And therefore, because he's playing second fiddle, he realized he can't go to the MPP. And so therefore, he has to be somewhere. So the moment Mama invited him, look, look at that, where Mama receiving. He said, look, uh, I mean, my good, my good friend, Ogusu Bempa, and then at that point, um, he said that uh, the applause went louder when his name was mentioned, and I'm not surprised. You see, the point is that they have actually really made. So, look, all that we are saying was that it was Ogusu Bempa himself who put himself in this ugly situation. And therefore, what seemed to be happening was something that he himself personally actually really let, I mean, created and should live with the shame and the disappointment that he has created for himself. If mama comes around and be careful, because presidency is not only one individual, but a group of people that will rule and they disappoint, he will be the most disappointed person if he realize for some reason that he's not able to, 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 to hold up 
for the criticism that will come along with it. Thank you very much. Yeah, religion, Christianity, omo ba, omo yane den. Yeah, twaso, ama sofufui egusu ebu. Yeah, ma amen. Hey, na Muhammad, oko bu sana di asu enti mi yano, omo ne bompa yamani yo. Hey, as I say, oye hu bibi, enti sadia ya twa banama na ya useless. So hono because ya pesi ya regulate Christianity. So hono. Muhammad enti mi, Muhammad mumti, enti ma confirm enti mi. On the way out. Hey, any abaya dino? Muhammad way out. On the way out. On the way out. On the way out. And yeah, Mahama ni kwa sanko for two abana de mano, because oba oba betwa and yomo yeno so because a chrono and our sofa for ne de air bono. Intimidia kakra win and pesa me de meka omotion omonya who be my to sesenya or call rewanda a po kigami ayeno no so no wa right churches all right. I must see so many name to me to me beam. All right, yeah that's it, yeah that's it. Maybe as gapa a tembra na so hey, maybe I'm going to quen 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 Na ayi, also for ya, wabo mwadi ya kuni ni. 